Yeah, g'day campers, what's happening? Welcome to The Modelling Show. I'm your host, Dwayne, and today we've got a very special guest. His name's Dave. You probably won't know him by his name, but I'm sure once you see some of the work he's done, you know exactly who he is. So listen to his story. It's a great one. He's really popular, and he's just a great guy as well. So take it away, Dave. Oh yes, well, um, thank you, Dwayne, for having me on and um, letting me tell my, my story of my, my modelling career. Um, yeah, as you say, people probably don't know me by name, but um, by face you may have seen me around a bit. Um, yeah, as I say, it was many, many years ago when I first got into the modelling gig. Um, did have a few photos out there and hadn't really heard much back, wasn't really um, kicking off. Then uh, one day I got a call from an agency, they said sort of come in, have, have a bit of a chat and we'll, um, we'll see what you like from there. Yeah, so I went in, did the photos and did the shoot, it was all good. They seemed happy with how it, how it came out. Um, and it wasn't until probably a couple of months later when I first um, saw saw myself out there in the public. So yeah, this is it. You've probably seen seen this many times where you need to go to the, go to the toilet, the male toilets. And there I am, you know, the person you look for. And there's, here's a picture of me with a, a lady I later to know, become known as Jane. And... Um, yeah, she was a uh, she was for the female toilets. Yeah, after this, I was a bit typecast of this uh, role, when I couldn't really get any more gigs or anything. I was putting myself out there, but um, nothing was available. Um, it wasn't you know till a while after that um, I did get a call to come back for another shoot for for the many different poses to try them out, and so yeah, went in and yeah, sort of kicked off a bit from there. So here's some of the pics that I've taken over the years. These are some where I joined up with Jane and some child models for some group shots that we did. This block is uh, safety photos that we were part of. They're, you know, putting the safety vest on, you know, slips and spills that could happen throughout, you know, workplaces and that. And we put them on signs and that to help people out to stop them from doing this. Uh, this was actually quite gruelling, um, this type of work, because, you know, the few injuries that I had, like falling off a ladder or injuring myself, which um, wasn't quite fun. The only good thing about this is I got some extra work and some extra pay from the uh, outcome of some of those videos where I did actually hurt myself. Oh yeah, thanks for putting this one up. This was just one I fell over and they took photos of. And yeah, here it is. Oh, this is just um, one of police and uh, firemen we did as a promo. So yeah, it's really, really busy for a lot there. Um, yeah, working sort of weekly and had not much time off, but yeah, after this, I had a bit of a break, which was good. Uh, I tried to get back into it, but there wasn't really uh, much else there. I think we had done most things, um, and I ended up, you know, getting into training a bit, getting quite fit, and yeah, it wasn't, I think it was because of this that I got a call up again uh, to do some promos for the Olympic Games and the Commonwealth Games. So yeah, that was that was a great experience, so showing different sports and things like that was, um, yeah, I really enjoyed that. And here are some photos from that shoot with uh, yeah, the different sports that we did. So yeah, I just want to say thanks for having me on the show. Thanks, Bill, for listening to my story. Uh, it's been great fun. I've had a really great career. I've been very, very lucky. And I might see you around soon.